Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Georgie the Duck Pineapple from Mariah Elizabeth. So let's get started. To draw this super cute duck, let's first start by drawing its beak. So I'm going to come right here and just give myself a point. And this is going to be the top of the beak right in the center. So from this point, I'm going to come down on both sides. You can kind of round this off, the top part off if you like. And bring it down the other side as well. From there, we're going to start to round it off for the corners. And then let's connect it at the bottom with a soft curve. So towards the center, it's going to be a little bit lower and then it's going to come back up. There, basic shape for this duck's beak. Then from there, let's, um, let's come to this bottom right here, really um, a little bit lower towards the bottom. And I'm just going to give myself another point right in the center. From there, I'm going to start a curve. I'm going to curve out and I come towards the corner of the mouth and out. So same thing on this side, just curve it out and go towards the corner of the mouth and out. And then let's come about right here, bring this out a little bit more, give our duck a very happy smile. And then on this area right here, we're gonna draw a curve to cap it off. There. Okay, so then from there, let's draw the eyes. We're going to come above this curve right here in this little pocket area, and we're going to draw a circle for the eyes. So um, let's say about right here, I'll start. And I'm just going to make big round eyes. So same thing on this side, about right here. And draw another circle. So it's right in this pocket. From there, I'm going to try to make them draw so cute eyes. <laughs> but if you don't want to, you can just add a little circle right here on each one to give it a highlight. But I'm going to try, since it's big enough, I'm going to add two small circles for highlights and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. And the lines at the bottom. So same thing on this side. So I want to thank you guys for all the requests to draw Georgie here and introducing me to uh, Georgie. <laughs> and thank you for all your love for my um, Mariah Elizabeth's Pickle the Dinosaur. So since you guys saw that one, you guys asked me to draw this little duck right here. And he's so cute. And um, hopefully I've done justice to Mariah's uh, little duck pineapple here. <laughs> Okay, so we have the drastic eyes. So then let's come above the eye. Now let's say about this area. I'm just going to draw a curve above each eye. And then in between, in the center area, I'm going to draw a little tough. So it's just kind of like a little two curves like that right in the center. And then now that we have this um, all in, we're going to come to the side right here and start to draw the big head. So let's start kind of like we're this curve is in this area we're going to come out and I'm just going to say about right here give myself a point and just to make it easier since I'm drawing kind of big I'm going to say about right here on the other side so about the same level so I know where I'm going from there I'm going to start to draw a big curve up so it's going to be a little bit straighter about in this area I'm just going to go back and forth and then I'm going to start to curve up so it's going to be above this little tuff of fur. And if you're using a pencil, just go ahead and round this off. But because I know there's this um, little stalk of um, pineapple leaves at the top, I'm going to have to leave that center part open so I can go ahead and draw that. So let's come back up. I'm going to find my center of this beak. Come up above. So let's say about right here. Just give myself a point. And from here, I'm going to start to draw the leaves. So I'm just going to go up with a curve. And same thing on the other side. And just go uh, one, three more. So I'm just going to go higher and higher. And one on this side. And one right in the center. There, so cute, right? 
and then let's bring let's finish this off so i'm just going to come about right there imagine it being overlapped and so coming out right here and going back okay so now from there i can bring this down a little bit more i'm just going to bring this curve and curve it in on this side so it ends kind of where the corner of this mouth is in this area and on this side i'm going to come out and draw a little this little hand right here that's kind of waving so it's going to come out with a curve and come down on that side there okay so then from here under right here i'm going to draw another little curve just imagine it continuing soft little curve and then on this side, now that we have this curve in from here, we're just going to draw another curve. And I'm going to bring it down to about the same level as that side. And then from there, we're going to start to draw the feet. So let's come bring this down a little bit. I'm going to start with a curve. So I'm going to start with the web feet. And there's going to be three curves. So let's bring this down. I'm just going to curve it out. And let's go two and three bring it in we're going to bring it back to about the same level and connect it there come in here and bring in the curve and so the same thing over here so let's start with a curve right in this area now that it's leveled and we're going to go two and three and once again bring this around to the same area at the bottom so i'm just giving myself a point come in and once again curve a little bit tuck it in and out okay so then from there nice and easy at the bottom right here you're just going to connect these two points with a curve right in the center oh <laughs> and then right here in this little area we're going to draw his other hand right here so about right here i'm just going to pop out a little curve and tuck it in and then oh one more thing right here he has this little curve right here <laughs> for a little belly button and um for the lines and the pineapple, I'm gonna do that when I color. So we're pretty much done with the drawing part. And I know there's a heart that I always add to my Jurassic Cute drawings, right? And I'll add that here on the uh, feet right here uh, when I color it. So let's get started with the coloring.
Lisa there. Hope you love how this super cute deck from uh, Mariah Elizabeth turned out and inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.